Hello, this is Survival Guyver, and today I'll be discussing the Sawyer Mini Water Filtration System. This tiny little filter can do a lot. So this one's got one of the highest ratings of any of the filters. And it's also a really good company. And I'll explain shortly, and I'll also leave a link in the description on um, Dan Becker, I believe is his name, um, who has a really good uh, couple of videos about Sawyer as a company. Um, so I do recommend taking a look at that as well. So Sawyer makes all different kinds of um, water filtration systems. This is their Mini. So it's literally quite tiny. It's got two ports on it. Uh, you can actually put this in line with your water reservoir in your backpack or bag. Uh, there's also a straw you can use with this. It comes with a small um, soft pouch kind of... Um, Water reservoir as well, you can do it that way. Um, I've even put them on, you can put them on a large bag and hang it from like a tree. And put this uh, downrange, you know, so it'll gravity feed in order to do a lot of water. Um, it takes a little while because it is a, um, uh, it is a, um, a uh, the hollow tube membrane on the inside, which is what a lot of them use, but this is kind of like a heavy duty version. So this filter is reusable up to 100,000 gallons, as long as it doesn't freeze. Now, if it's cold and the filter freezes and there's no water that's ever been used in it, it should be fine. But once you get water inside the membrane on the inside, once it freezes, you have no idea what kind of damage it's going to do to the inside. There's no way to tell. So for safety, if you ever get this frozen after water has gone through it, we recommend throwing it away or recycling it properly. But let me show you what's in here because there's a bunch of stuff in here. All right. um, here on the back it shows it comes with a mini filter, a cleaning plunger, a drinking straw, and a 16 ounce pouch. Um, it's about two ounces, uh, ways to use it. You can squeeze it, bottle, straw, or inline. So this will also work for a gravity feed, which also works really cool. So let me open this up for you here. So, first things first, there's the filter. They actually come in a bunch of different colors or stickers. Uh, this one's orange, makes it easy to find. So, flow obviously goes that way, so your mouth would be that direction. Okay. It's got a little cap. I don't have much light in here, sorry. I'll try to a little bit better there. Um, and this side, you can see how it connects to kind of like a bottle. Yeah, let me see if I can get the lights just a little bit closer here. It's a little easier to see. So it's got a little o ring on the inside, almost like a hose kind of thing. Do not, do not, and they stress this in the instructions, do not put it on a faucet or on a hose, uh, like a garden hose. Even if the threads fit, the water pressure. This is only good for about 20 PSI. The water pressure can easily destroy it. Most houses are 40 to 50 PSI. Um, so a faucet or anything of that nature, house water supply would destroy it. So keep it on a minimum. So it's actually you know, super light, 0 0.1 micron absolute hollow filter membrane water filter. I don't know if you can actually see that. There we go. Okay, so let's see what else is in here. We go. So here's the bag. Gives you instructions on how to backwash the filter. So when the filter flow slows, you will need you will need cleaning. Uh, this is normal to clean the filter. Follow the steps below. Remove the cap uh, filter from the pouch. Remove uh, push pull cap. Fill syringe with clean water. Place tip of syringe on the opening. Uh, that the push-pull cap was on, aim the filter away from yourself, vigorously squirt water from the syringe into the filter, repeat several times. And they talk about storage as well, uh, especially, um, they tell you not to over-chlorinate it as well, which makes sense. So, also has some instructions on the bag on how to use it, but that's always good news. Of course, it does screw right on top. So, that's awesome. And it comes with, you know, this is closable, so that's good news. 
takes up little to no room. This is the syringe for backwashing it, not for medical use, just a basic syringe. All right? And that would go that way, you will actually back flush in the opposite direction. Okay? Here is a cap for the container. And this is a flexible straw. So, put the straw on either side. Preferably, you know, whichever direction it's going is, you could drink directly out. The water's on this side. You could even put it on this side and drink from the other side. You know, you have a lot of options. On the inside of the package, there's more helpful tips and tricks on how to make sure you get the most out of it, specifically extra care. And let me show you one more thing. Hold on for one second. Okay, so this is a Smart Water brand bottle. I get them at most grocery stores and gas stations, at least around here. Um, this is a one liter container with 33.8 fluid ounces. One liter. These are actually really good. They're strong and they're nice and clear. Obviously, you can always take the sticker off. But let me show you something nice about this. This common thread fits this. up and there you go so that is a one liter bottle that you can add to it so if you wanted to you could fill this side fill this smart water bottle up with dirty water and you could hang it from something on a uh, like paracord and you can have it gravity feed or you can actually reverse this you know put the straw on the one side and try to pull water in So it goes into the bottle. You know, you have a lot of options. Um, but there is a, they are actually a really cool company. I'm trying not to make a mess here. Um, so Sawyer donates, for every one of these that they sell, they donate another one of these to an area of the world that needs it, like some of the African countries where they do not have clean drinking water. Well, they have a program where they're trying to bring clean drinking water using their filters there. And they do it for free. So it's like it's like a huge amount of their proceeds go to getting water to the places in the world that don't have it. So that's awesome. So in the description will be a <clears throat> excuse me, will be a link to Amazon where you can get these. I'm gonna link the Sawyer website and a Sawyer donation page. So if you want to donate to them directly, you can. Um, so I'm going to put their Amazon page as well, as I said. And I'm going to also link you to Dan Becker's um, channel so you can see more about these Sawyer filters. They're, they're an awesome company and I like them. So that is it. Uh, thank you for watching. If you're interested in anything else like this, please like it. So I can see, you know, the more likes on a certain video tells me what you're specifically looking at. Unless you decide to tell me in the comments, and please feel free to hit me up in the comments as well. I usually answer them pretty quickly. And if you like anything else on the channel, please subscribe. Um, I'm going to continue to come out with more stuff. Uh, as I said, I'm going to do a review on the other two water filtration systems I have, which are both common. Well, one of them is common, one of them is not so common, depending on the, where you are in the world. Um, there's going to be some more knives, there's going to be different kinds of cordage, there's all sorts of stuff coming up. So please, give me a like, and a comment, whatever. Um, but this way I can find out what you guys are interested in and hopefully get more of what you're looking into. So thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.